Good morning, ambitious anglers. Welcome to our very first episode of Will It Lure? I'm Brody. One of the most common questions I get is what lures work best for a particular fish species. The point of this series is to give you guys guidance on what lures to purchase. So letting me go out, spend my hard earned money on these lures, go out here, test them for you guys to see, and then that way whenever you go to a fishing tackle shop, in store or online, you won't feel overwhelmed on what lure to purchase. I do abide by a few guidelines in the series. Number one, we have to pick a target species and they have to be actually here. Number two, we have to pick a lure that will have some chance of success, keeping in mind the features of color, size, and the bait in the area. Number three, I will show you the action of the lure and how to fish the lure itself. And number four, we'll rate the lure. If it catches zero fish, it will not lure. If it catches one fish, it will indeed lure. And if it catches three or more fish, I'll give it the ambitious angler seal of approval for you guys to go out and get it now. A little disclosure, some of these lures may work or may not work depending on the location and the time that they are fished. So today's target species is striped bass, which is the most plentiful fish species here in PEI. So for today's first Willet Lure episode, I'm gonna go with the Yozuri Mag Darter guys by Yozuri. I'm not affiliated with them at all. I have two versions here guys, one in the bone color and one in the ghost black color. This one here is five inch, this one here is four and one eighth inch. They imitate a mullet bait fish. Now we don't have mullet up here in PEI Canada, but if I can kind of compare them to any kind of bait fish, it would be something like a smelt. These guys come standard with treble hooks. So what I did was replace the trebles on this one with, I think they're 2.0 or 3.0 uh, single inline, uh, and then I just crimped the barbs on them. And then I added a split ring at the top of the mouth just because there's actually no split rings that come with them. And with this one here, I definitely put the 2.0 hooks on. The main method of fishing these lures is by just simple cast and retrieve, but I wouldn't be surprised if you could troll them as well. So I'll show you guys how these perform in the water as it's being retrieved. So this is the action that the Yozuri Mag Darter provides, guys. So as you retrieve it, it does have a very tight side-to-side -side wobble, but every so often it will sway left and right. And for these, I'll leave a link in the description below on where to purchase them. So the main food source that could be in this area right now uh, for the striped bass are anything from sand shrimp all the way to minnows or gudgeons, all the way up to mackerel. It is August 25th currently in PEI, so there is a lot of bait around, so they'll eat pretty much anything that comes by. And I'm gonna be fishing these Uzeri Mag Darters around a channel ledge that goes right behind me around these rocks. We have an outgoing tide for the next four hours, and this seems to be the best spot uh, to do it. It is early morning, it's between 6.30 and 7.00, 7 a.m. and we have uh, sunny skies uh, for the rest of the day. We're gonna start with the ghost black in low light and then we're gonna shift over to the bone whenever the sun rises. So without further ado, will the Yozuri Mag Darter lure? Let's find out. Okay guys, it's early morning. I didn't want to film my intro right away until it brightens up, but it's just approaching 6 a.m. I'm gonna throw on the four and one eighth inch black ghost Yozuri Mag Darter. Will it lure? Let's find out. Here we go. Okay, just a constant retrieve. I'm not doing anything else other than constant retrieve. Striper's right in front of me, guys. Like, there's so many. Four, trying to be super three, quiet. Two, one. Got him. There we go. Oh, they're super active this morning. God, are they ever. I don't want to spook them. They're so close to the rocks right now. Oh, they're right beside me too. Oh my God, they're everywhere right now. This is a nice striper. Really nice. Not a bad one to start, that's for sure. That's a pretty nice one. Oh yeah, that's a nice one. That's a dandy. Okay. All right guys, there we go. Yozuri Mag Darter, four and one eighth inch, ghost black, low light conditions. It does indeed lure, guys. Let's get him back. Get on these rocks here. Let's get this guy a nice release. Thank you for being my first fish on Will It Look. There he goes. Awesome. Perfect. All right, let's continue. 
try that again, guys. It's pretty quick, right off the bat. Oh, there's a hit. There we go, got one. Oh, he just wound up, ain't ya? Okay, let's get him. Oh. No! <laughs> there's two, guys. We got two. Slow my retrieve down maybe a little bit. Oh, there we go, right away. There we go, guys. We're on our third one right now. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get him in or not. Yeah, if I can get him up here. Oh. All right, third one, guys, on the Ozuri Mag Darter. Technically two, but we'll count three since the second one uh, did make it to the rocks. A cool feature about these Yozuri mag darters is they actually have a concave lip that's built into the lure itself. That way, whenever you're retrieving this plug, you don't have a chance of breaking off the plastic lip or the metal lip that might actually be on them. So if you guys are looking for the mag darters online or in store, they get as small as the three and a half inch and all the way up to the six and a half inch version. There we go, got it, ah, dang. There we go. Oh, nice hit. Nice take there. Nice. There it is, guys. Number four on the Yuzuri Mag Darter. Four and one eighth inch ghost black color. Oh, well, that's four so far, guys. That's great. There we go. Head shakes. Not that way, bro. This way. Don't pull me in the current now. Oh, he's over there. I gotta get him on this side. Oh, sh that was close. Where are you at? Oh. Whoa, that's slippy. These boots are not grippy on rocks. Gotcha. Okay, there we go. Oh, and there we go, guys. The fifth striper on the Yozuri Mag Darter. Didn't even get a chance to put the bone colored one on, guys. But I'm gonna give this lure, the Ambitious Angler, seal of approval to go out and get it now. Okay, guys, seems kind of pointless, but uh, we'll throw on the five inch bone colored Mag Darter and uh, see if it lures. We already know it does, but we gotta try it. And I am throwing these Yozuri Mag Darters on a 10 foot Shimano Speedmaster medium rod. And that's paired with a Shimano Saragossa 6000 salt water. And I got 30 pound braid and 30 pound fluoro. It's usually my normal setup when I'm uh, doing any kind of surf fishing or any kind of bank fishing from shore. And the only reason why I'm using the 10 footer just to get the casting distance because whenever it gets low tide, you really want to get out to that channel ledge as best you can. Um, these are best to be fished across the current or against the current. But right here in particular, there's no current. Um, just kind of like where they want to stage. So they'll pick off anything that comes through as far as bait fish goes. Oh, I don't think I got them still. Hook set. Okay, buddy, let's get you up here. Up. There we go. Okay, guys, there's another beauty schoolie on the Missouri Mag Darter. Oh, here you go, buddy. There he goes. So these Yozuri mag darters can go at depths of one to four feet. The smaller the lure, the less it'll dive, but the bigger the lure, the more it'll dive. So this one here will probably get me down to two and a half to three feet or so. Another hit, come on. Last catch of the morning on the Yozuri mag darter, bone color. Number five, that brings us to 10 total on the mag darters this morning. They work, guys. Okay, striper released. Ambitious angler seal of approval already given. If you guys did enjoy the video and want to see more Will It Lures, give this video a like, leave a comment below, and subscribe if you haven't already. And please share this video if anybody else is looking to get into striper fishing and needs to know what lures work good. So until the next episode, you guys stay determined to cast because you are destined to catch. Take care.